News from News 8. Breaking news in our Sunrise Smart Start this morning. A violent night. Five teenagers in the hospital after multiple shootings in Rochester. Carmela Boykin is live outside Strong Memorial with the latest on their conditions and the investigation. Carmela, good morning. Good morning, Mark. It was a violent night overnight indeed. I'm outside Strong Memorial Hospital where four of those five teenagers are receiving care from a single shooting incident last night. It began on Henyon Street at 7 p.m. when police responded to the report of a shooting in the 100 block. Two 16-year-old girls were found with upper body gunshot wounds and a 15-year-old boy was found with at least one lower body gunshot wound. All three were taken here to Strong Memorial Hospital by ambulance and another 15-year-old girl was found with a lower body gunshot wound and taken to the hospital separately. RPD officials say despite understaffing, the officers handled this tragic situation well. Certainly we are understaffed and certainly it is a stressful time, uh, but the uh, members of the Rochester Police Department are doing a fine job. All shootings are tragedies. Uh, however, when it's uh, victims that are so young, it is especially difficult. Again, police say that all four teenagers are being treated here for non-life-threatening injuries. They said that the investigation is ongoing and that there is no current danger to the public. In Rochester, Carmela Boykin, News 8. Mark. Carmela, thank you for the live update from the hospital. Uh, now to that fifth shooting victim. Police investigating after a 16-year-old girl shot on North Street last night. They responded to the area near Dernan Street around 8 o'clock. That teenager taken to the hospital, we're told, with non-life-threatening injuries. There are no suspects in custody. Anyone with information about either of these shootings involving five teenagers.